Hey guys, what's up? It's QB time, and in today's video we have an unboxing from my friend Andrew. So as you can see, um, I got an unboxing from my friend at school, and this is my friend Andrew from the very beginning of QB time that actually uh, made a couple videos at the very beginning. So, and he's basically quitting cubing, but he still has a couple puzzles, but he gave me a lot of his old puzzles, so let's just take a look at what we got. Alright, we're going to be starting out with the 2x2s, and the first one here is a Rubik's brand 2x2, two two. it turns absolutely terrible, um, it's just a crappy little puzzle that he thought he'd throw in there, I guess. Next, we have a Cyclone Boys 2x2. Two two. Now, this was his main 2x2, two two, and he has his on much tighter tensions than I have mine. And it's actually pretty nice. Uh, I have one of these, and this actually does turn pretty nicely. It's uh, it's okay, actually. The next puzzle that he gave me was his old main. It's his Fang Shi Shuang Ren version 1. Um, this is a pretty nice puzzle. Uh, it's in white, because he likes the white cubes, as you'll see as we go along here. Um, this is a pretty nice puzzle. It turns a lot better than my Fang Shi, I think, maybe. Um, it's pretty nice, I like how it feels, and now I have a version 1 that isn't, uh, the Illusion Cube. Now let's go to 4x4s, we have the Yuxin 4x4 in white. This is a really nice puzzle, um, he has it set up very, very smoothly, it turns very buttery, and it's overall pretty nice. I really enjoy how he has his set up, it's really, really smooth, and it's tight, but, uh, I really enjoy it anyways, I also... Now have this one in white and black. The next puzzle is a 5x5, five five, and it's just a Shangshao 5x5. Five five. Now I have two of these, but I don't know. I might try to Florian mod this or something. I don't really know. Um, this one actually does turn better than my 5x5, um, five five, and the stickers are 10 times better. So I might end up doing something with the other one, but we'll see. Um, it turns really smooth for a Shangshao. It's not as crispy as my other one. So, yep, it's pretty, pretty nice. Um... I could definitely do something with it. Um, sticking with WCA Puzzles, his favorite, the uh, Mega Minx. Andrew absolutely hated Mega Minx, and I bet he really loved to get rid of this. It turns very badly. I'm pretty sure he didn't do anything to it out of the box. It's a white Shang Shao. So now I have a white one and a black one, so I might make a Siamese. Tell me what you think about that in the comments if I should make a Siamese Mega Minx. Next, we have a Moyus Cube. Now I have three of these, but uh, this one is very tight. It's, uh, it's not lubed very much at all, so I might end up doing something to it, but it turns okay as of now. Um, it's, it's a nice puzzle. Um, he obviously didn't use it that much. It's not very broken in. And then we have this 3x3x2. Uh, three this is a land land. I also have this one. Um, this one's white though. I have a black one. It turns pretty nicely. Um, I'm not really going to use it for anything. I'll just probably just sit there. But it looks nice in the collection. And then he has a Calvin's and Tony Fisher 3x3x4. This is a very expensive version of the land land or the Q for you actually. Um, this one doesn't turn, I don't think, as well. It locks up. Um, but it's overall pretty nice. He has it on super loose tensions. Um, it corner cuts actually pretty nicely. Um, it turns okay, but it's very, very loose. Alright, that's about it for cubes, but he also gave me a couple more things in here. Starting with a basically full bottle of Marlube, so that'll be put to good use. Thank you, Andrew. And he gave me a couple sets of stickers here. This is a... Shang Shao 5x5 and a uh, Yuxin 4x4 set. I kind of want to see the shades that he picked out. Um, they don't really seem very different. Uh, I think they're just normal shades. Let's check out the 5x5 shades. I usually don't check out stickers, but I'm kind of curious. Oh, and there's also 3x3 stickers in here. All right, nice. I actually kind of like that um, contrast there. The green. Yeah, that's pretty nice. And then the 5x5. Yep, they're just kind of fluoro shades, not really anything special. And then finally, I got a new stack mat and timer. Uh, now, I'm really going to replace this one because this one's kind of dirty. It has some stains here, here, and stuff like that. So, I'll probably be using this one. And I finally got a new timer. Now, let me show you my old timer compared to this one. 
This one is so worn out and dirty, the reset button's done, and it barely works at all if you can get it on. This one is such a... <laughs> much better than this one that barely turns on anymore so this one's basically trash and yep uh, that's about it so I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing for my friend Andrew go all the way back to my first cube collection video and check it out you can find him in that video so I hope you guys enjoy comment what you want to see next to my channel and as always thank you guys for watching bye